I uh, was down here at the boat landing and um, like I saw a little turtle and he kept swimming up under the rocks and then I saw him again and I missed him and then the next time he went back under the rocks again and um, I saw half his body poking out so I grabbed him and I pulled him out and it's not a turtle I've ever seen before and it's um, this uh, striped, uh, striped necked musk turtle and um, this is the first musk turtle we've uh, caught this year and uh, he seems like he's pretty aggressive he's got his mouth open and um, the uh, so here's what he looks like okay. can you see him good? Mm -hmm. alright um, the small ones uh, mainly feed on uh, insects but uh, as they get older they start to feed on snails and clams and uh, which uh, with their mouth they can uh, crush it with that real sharp mouth and uh, they actually start um, releasing musk even before they're born but uh, he's a real neat looking little turtle and um, I'm surprised we caught this he's got a really large head I wish if he'd poke it out y'all could see he might poke it out a little bit um, yeah he's really really neat looking he's got these cool little spots on his head and uh, sort of a cool little pattern um, uh -uh. Alright, there he goes. Can you see his head? See, he's got a cool little pattern. He's uh, pretty secretive. He doesn't really want to... He doesn't want to come out too much, but... Also, um, he's got that shell. It's uh, like most musk turtles have. It doesn't cover their whole bottom area. It's just a little shell all the way across like that. But, uh, it's really cool. He's got real fleshy looking skin. Unlike the box turtles which are really rough. Sort of like snake skin. Um, he's, a, he's a pretty cool little turtle. You see that mouth? It looks real mean. But uh yeah, like I said, this is the first musk turtle we've caught this year, so I'm you know, pretty happy about this. So we came down here to try to get Amber to catch a water snake, but we haven't seen one yet. But um, I'm glad we've got another turtle species because we haven't been seeing many turtles. Except mainly the only thing we see down here is the sawback turtles. So this was uh, this was something new. But yeah, he's real neat looking. Um. They mainly hide under rocks and stuff, is where you usually see them, and that's where we saw them, and under logs and vegetation. So, uh, but yeah, he's cool, and we're gonna, um, here's the size of him. Oh, <laughs> he's going to take off. Yeah. See, he's got that webbed feet for swimming real good. And, uh, yeah, he's got a real cool looking little head. He almost took off on me. Is that real cool looking? Little body. Alright. Okay, let's see if he'll move around. Alright. He don't want to move around now. He definitely wants to bite me. But, uh, I guess we're gonna, um, try to get some good close-up pictures of him. And then, uh, we'll release him, uh, back in the water where we found him. Anything you want to say about him? That he's very cute, that he's very cute, and he's his mouth kind of looks like it's froze, but yeah. he's very home, but without it. Put him back in the water and let him eat and stuff. Yeah, I mm -hmm. think he's hungry for me. <laughs> he's going to bite me. He does look hungry, though. But yeah, but alright, we're going we're gonna to let him... Uh, we're going to get some pictures of him first, and then we'll film uh, letting him go. We're going to go ahead and release him back onto the rocks. And watch him take off. 
Yeah.